Hello guys, I want us to go through uh, a system that is a school management system. Therefore, we start by demonstration. Therefore, our system roads. Then, once our system roads like that, you key in the credentials of your system. My credentials are done, done. And therefore, you see from this point, uh, I am logged in as done. And my system will be used to register students. Therefore, I can be in a position to uh, capture student registration and also data entry. And for that case, if I click on student registration, uh, I can be in a position to capture a student here. Therefore, you can just see, you can capture the, the registration number, name, date of birth, age, gender, state, the local government, etc. Uh, and also you can be in a position to uh, look at the classes here. You can also choose the terms, first term, second term, the relationship of the runner with the person who has uh, brought him or her for registration. Then I cross that one. When we go to data entry here, you see now I can be in a position to capture the fees here. Like now I can be in a position to capture the fees paid by these students here, like that. Then I can choose the date paid uh, by these guys here, if I can be in a position to, to do that. Then once I do that one, uh, that way, I can just go to part of his paid. Let's say this guy has paid 2300 of the part, and also this one has paid the same, uh, that way. So after having done that, I can also go to books in case there are some book payments done. You can just uh, have it captured there that way. Therefore, you can do that. Then you can also uh, uh, give the date. The date books were uh, given. Then the uniform, in case there are some payment of the uniform, it can be captured here uh, in this system like that then you see notice that also the date the uniform was given uh, will be uh, captured there then in case there are any other remarks ladies and gentlemen then you can just add remarks here like uh, uh, fees were paid were paid like that way this one you can also just say is, is paid uh, that is for the uh, remarks so after having done that uh, ladies and gentlemen uh, you can just uh, cross the app here therefore you can just cross that one then I may wish to uh, see the statements therefore the statement will actually appear here you can also be in a position to see or view the class lists like for example you can just type a class here uh, uh, the class that is the the class like for example you can just confirm oh, we have this class here if i can just have this one therefore if i go to this one then i can be in a position to see the class list therefore you can see round one there is this uh, person here and on the other hand if I go to these tables here you do notice that uh, 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 the the data that I have keyed in here if I delete this the data that I have keyed in has been captured in my system if you can see this data has been captured in my uh, system therefore uh, as uh, if we just go back here here and capture new data since I have deleted the one that was there you'll notice that um, now if I feed data here my statement will have the data then there is the settings in case uh, I need to uh, do the admin there is these settings here where I can set term 1 I can set term 2 I can set term 3 
I can also promote students to the next year and also update them to previous year if need be. And for this gentlemen, that is a, a good system, that is a school management system that you can uh, really uh, come up with. The tables involved, you can just go to design view. Therefore, if you just go to design view here, you'll be in a position to see the uh, the that is the tables, the data that I, that is the tables used, and also you can be in a position to see the the next table. This these are the the fields that um, I have used. Then we have the fields used in the in the other table here. Therefore, this is how you can just come up with a simple uh, school management system uh, using Microsoft Access. And therefore, thank you very much for watching. See you in my next session.